What I'm going to show you in this video is Management Console 1.5 that does auto config. Uh, what I'm showing right now is that auto conf this uh, zero client is set for firmware 3.2.1. It's also not been discovered yet on my Management Console, but as it's powering up, it's about to be discovered. So we'll refresh the page and we'll see that it's now discovered. On the autoconfig page under groups, you're going to see that it automatically joined a group. So if I go back to groups, you'll see that the thing's been discovered and it's already a member of a group. This is done by a policy inside of groups that I'm not going to get into in this video. Um, so the next step is inside the policy. We want to have the policy apply and we also want to have firmware updated. So inside the policy, there's this new setting uh, for firmware. Uh, profile firmware and basically I set a rule that says force people to be at a certain version of firmware in this case 3.4 so si since this uh, device just got discovered it's going to automatically apply the profile uh, and apply the firmware so it's currently at 321 I'm gonna flip back to the device here it's rebooting I did not tell it to reboot it did that all by itself and you can already notice that the Things have changed. It's already got the VU connection server and the firmware is 3.4. So going back, we're going to refresh on the management console. And we're just going to verify that it is actually on firmware 3.4, which was completely done automatically without anything from me.